ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, you are watching Remstar Says So. Alright then, let's get right into this guys. Um, I'm just going to say off the bat, like, this channel is a friendly channel for people to come, watch my videos, leave comments, um, and have mature boxing conversations. Go and watch my intro video, um, Introduction to Remstar Says So. This is a channel about boxing. Every so often you might see me drop a video about football and tennis. If you're from the USA, that's what we call soccer, or what you guys call soccer. Anyway, like, I'm just going to come straight off the bat. Like Trolls and fangirls, fanboys, whatever you guys want to call yourself, you lot ain't going to be tolerated. You're not welcome around here. This is a, com this is a channel where I give my opinion. <clears throat> and I'm just here stating what I believe. This is not a channel that's going to pander to you fanboys, to you Eddie Hearn fanboys, you AJ fanboys. If that's what you want, if you want a channel that is going to talk about Anthony Joshua all day, every day, like, you know, this is not the place to be. If you look at the content of my videos, I'm giving a broad depth of my views of boxing as a whole. Um, so, you know, if you just want to, a channel that's going to talk about how great Eddie Hearn is and start lying to you and talking about how good the cards on the zone have been. Uh, you're in the wrong place, bruv. You're in the wrong place. So I'm going to get straight onto this because I've recently made a video about um, one of my commenters who could be a sub um, who said that Dimitri Bivol should go down and fight Callum Smith. That's great. That is mature boxing conversation. But there's one geezer that I don't even really know what his issue is. Um, and he's jumped on my channel and he just started chatting shit. I just got to pull man up. Obviously for GDPR and all that BS, can't really say man's name and that, but like, you know, I'll let you lot find them if you want to. It was on my um, Usyk has no business at the heavyweight division. Um, and this fanboy, like, I said that Usyk and Eddie Hearn should campaign Usyk in Ukraine and other countries in Eastern Europe to um you know exploit the eastern european market he was just like remstar you make it sound like it's a negative that Usyk has fought consistently away from home nah fam i didn't say that i said that he should look to build on his own market dominate eastern europe and then you know you can move into other markets like germany and that similar to what the klitschko's did like you know we've got all these good eastern european boxers especially coming out of the lights of ukraine what is man doing campaigning in America and England? Like, you know, you've got all of your so-called fans back in Eastern Europe. Um, why not go and give them something to watch? I mean, I'm sure these guys have got money. I'm sure they can go and, you know, dip their hands in their pockets. Um, so, yeah, I, I just didn't understand that. And he's like, and that, to be fair, is just the tip of the iceberg regarding your analysis. Man, the brother said to me, 27 followers, says it all. Well, you know, what I'm going to say is, yes, I, I'm a new channel. I've been going for about five weeks, six weeks tops. You know, I've only got a couple of followers, but that's because I don't pander to fans. I'm not kissing ass. So, you know, those channels that blow up quickly generally do. I'm just giving my opinion. And I've checked it today and I've actually got 28 followers now. So fuck you, you dickhead. Um... <clears throat> What I want to say is thank you to anybody who has subscribed to this channel. Thank you to anybody who hasn't subscribed that comes back and watches regularly. Thank you to people that leave comments. Thank you to people that leave likes. Um, you know, I want to have sensible, mature boxing conversations with people that, you know, want to state their opinion. I don't think that any opinion is wrong. What makes this guy even more of a dickhead uh, is that I clicked on his name. And this Don has released like four or five videos over the course of about a year. And he's got about three or four subscribers. So if I've managed to get 28 subscribers in six weeks, what is this pussy all doing? Like, I just don't understand it. So yeah, like anybody who's coming on this fanboyish BS, anybody who's coming to troll, like please just go away because I'll just end up blocking you off the channel or some other things like that. Like, do you know what I mean? I don't really care. This channel doesn't generate money, so I'm not dying for views or anything like that. I'm just giving my 
honest, humble opinion. If you like it, great. If you don't, like, do you know what I mean? You can respond to my videos in certain ways. Like, at the end of the day, I'm happy I've got 28 subscribers in five, six weeks. I didn't even know if I'd have 10. So you know what? I'm happy. Thank you to everybody who comes back. This is just my little response. And, you know, anybody who leaves comments, I'll try and make response videos. Um, you know, just like the guy who said that Bivol and um, Callum Smith should fight. So, you know, I'm there. I'm watching I'm watching the comments. They flash up during the day, so on and so forth. Um, so, yeah, if you're a fanboy... If you're a fan girl, if you're a troll, you're not going to be com you're not going to be tolerated here. There's plenty of channels that are going to panda and give you the exact sort of video that you like. Anyway, guys, you're watching Remstar says so.